Hello everyone, Derek here from Addictive Tips. In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect to servers and such with the GNOME file manager. So to start off, open up your file manager. Uh, doesn't matter, matter where you open it up to because we're going to go straight here to the other locations tab. So this tab is where all the important stuff is. So let's start off with the FTP. So you can connect to an FTP server with the GNOME file manager by going to the other, to the connect to server area right here, typing in FTP, colon slash slash, and then just paste the IP address or host name. And then you can connect with your user credentials and access your server. So now as you can see here, I've got my FTP connection here. Uh, I connected to my Ubuntu cloud server that I have and we can see all of the all of the files and folders and I can access and do whatever I want with it. So that is how you connect to FTP. So to connect to Samba you can do SMB followed by a host name or IP address. Let's connect to my NAS. And that should, yep, it should take me directly to my Seagate uh, NAS thing I got set up here. And uh, that's that's that. That's how you connect to Samba. This also works with NFS. Now, I don't have an NFS server available. I, I don't use it. But uh, you can do NFS followed by the connection information. You can also reveal other connection info for the GNOME file manager, as we see right here. And uh, if you can't figure out the name of the device or the IP address or protocol, it shows up here under networks. As you can see, uh, if we go here, we see my Samba server, we see my FTP right here, and all in Windows network, we see all these other things here. So just a quick guide on how to connect to servers through the GNOME file manager. I hope you guys like this video and I will see you in the next one.